fighting for homes first workers. They've been out on a picket line since Monday. We've asked the employer to come back to the bargaining table and they refuse to do so. Uh, this, these members have turned down quite a bad offer twice uh, and this management just doesn't seem to get it that they just need a little bit something to improve their contract to get back to providing the services that they provide to the clients. Well today our members are here to uh, to bring attention to their strike to city councillors and ask them a few you know questions and and maybe they should start asking some questions some of the questions they should be asking is like uh, you know where's the transparency in in this group homes first uh, I, I think that's an honest question I think it's a question that not only the workers uh, deserve an answer to but uh, the community and uh, the councillors definitely uh, should be having answers to they can't stand back and say this is a dispute between some workers and alarms like the agency because Homes First does crucial work for this city of Toronto, the largest urban centre in this country. Homes First Management, shame on you! Homes First Management, shame on you! Homes First Management, shame on you! These workers support the homeless when they get off the street. They come in and they find shelter and there's a number of things that they have to do to prepare their, themselves for a life in the future. And these workers help them through the through a myriad of forms, getting to doctor's appointments and filling out forms that they need to, to get financial uh, monies to, so that they can eventually be on their own. I work primarily with um, homeless individuals that have uh, mental health and addiction issues um, in a shelter environment. So um, mental health, addiction, you can imagine um, the amount of services that I have to provide. I have to do informal counseling, I'm a negotiator, you know, I liaise with community agencies like lawyers, doctors, any agency that's, um, you know, advocate a great deal on behalf of my clients. Um, to help them find housing and to, to set goals and just improve their conditions. I know that uh, Homes First is a, is a critical program for uh, homeless and vulnerable people in our city. In my community, uh, I know that Homes First is operating an important shelter there and uh, I'm really concerned. Um, I know it's really hard work to work with homeless folks, uh, that there's a lot that, need, that people need in those shelters and it's a hard job and uh, workers there need the support and respect of management and, uh, and they need to be treated fairly. So I'm here to lend my support to OPSU and to ask management to get back to the table uh, to meet with workers um, and to, to settle on a contract that's fair uh, and respectful. All we want is a fair contract. All we want is not to have things cut. We're not asking for much in return. We just want you to come back to the table. Negotiation means looking at two sides. Negotiation doesn't mean imposition. It doesn't mean oppression. So we want them to get back to the table and bargain in good faith.